Yep. It's a hump bump bumpy day. It's a hump bump bumpy day. It's Wednesday, the 25th of January, 2017. <laughs> yep. Let's get to business, because I don't know if this is really what you want to hear. National Irish Coffee Day. I can live with that. We have two or three of them. Of course, regular coffee is good, but National Irish Coffee Day. <sighs> if you haven't tried it, try it before you say no. <laughs> then this one kind of scratched my head. National Opposite Day. So instead of saying good morning in the morning, I'm supposed to say good night. Instead of saying hello to you, I'm supposed to say goodbye. If I'm hot, I'm supposed to say I'm cold. If I like you, I'm supposed to say you're a scumbag. Hmm. Uh, let's see. If you're very intelligent, I should call you an idiot or stupid. Hmm. And if somebody doesn't know it's opposite day, I might find my nose on my opposite side of my face. It says that's how you celebrate. Walk up to somebody and say the opposite. Say opposite of what you're feeling. Hmm. I like that person. So I'm going to walk up and go, you're the most detestable person I've known. I don't like you. Come on. Get a grip, people. Some of these things are really, really stupid. Quote of the day. It is better to be a lion for a day than a sheep all your life. Elizabeth Kenny. It is better to be a lion for a day than a sheep all your life. Hmm. Yeah. Think about it a little bit. Somebody want to know about my humidors? Well, if you look over this shoulder, that's my adult beverage locker, otherwise known as the office refrigerator. If you look over this shoulder, you'll see a cooler door, a humidor on top, and a humidor on the bottom, and a huge humidor on the bottom. Not including the humidor over there, and three travel humidors down there, and so I got cigars all over. Well, yeah, I run a cigar business, and we're even going to get more so when we open the shop. So, okay, and I don't display. The problem is with displaying what I got in my humidor, I get three or four people say, awesome, awesome, awesome. And then I go get somebody who goes, you smell those rippers if you the dog rockets. Hey, one man dog rocket is another man's favorite. And I defy anybody to go out and at least try something different. I know some of these people, they have one brand or one series of cigars. And that's it. They don't try anything else. Oh, I love it. I love it. I did get to try that thing out. It's like the guy who likes steak and taters and eats steak and taters every day of his life and never tries anything else. Couldn't, you know, doesn't want barbecued beef. Doesn't want smoked brisket. Can't think of pulled pork because he wants his steak and taters. Oh, yeah, and don't give him french fries, and don't give him a baked potato. He wants them mashed taters. You know? Anyway, I smoking today one of my newest favorite in the last 90 days. dun 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 It be a big and beefy. <laughs> mm.
big and beefy. This one's the 6x60. They have a 5x60. They have a 7x60. They also have, I think, a 7x70 coming out. Yeah. Awesome cigars. So stand up for yourself. Be the lion for the day. And don't forget, it's better than being a sheep all your life. Somebody said, oh, congratulations. A friend of mine is getting married. And I, when I met the couple, the first thing I asked him when I had him apart, I said, did, did she buy the ring yet? And she, he said, what? I said, yeah, the ring. Because <laughs> I tell you what, he's going to be a sheep the rest of his life if he says I do. Anyway, out there, you know, it's an equal thing. That one ain't going to be. Anyway, hey, smoke what you like, like what you smoke, and above all, kick some big and beefy ash today.